Okay, for this project, you actually need a piece of um, black cardstock, but that's kind of hard to see on the screen, so I decided I'm going to show it to you on white. You're going to cut it down to 8.5 by 10. So just take an inch off the 11 inch side. And this is for a notepad that measures 3 by 7.5. So this is the notepad. Just got it at a dollar in a dollar store. It actually has a magnet on the back that we're going to take off. All right, so let's get to the scoring. So we'll start with it this way. This is the eight and a half inch side up at the top. So I'm going to take my stylus here and this one is for the other direction. So we're going to score these three here and this is four and an eighth. Oops. Okay. And then four and a half, and then four and seven eighths. Okay, now we're going to turn it. So now the 10 inch side is across this top, and I'm going to score at two inches. All right. So for the next step here, with it in this position here, the score line's going down this way and then the two inch one here. We're going to add a piece of sticky strip in the bottom corner here from the score line down. And then I'll come in a little closer so you can see actually what we're cutting off. So from the score line, we're going to cut all those score lines up in that corner off. And I've brought in my black now um, and that's where I'm going to do that on. Okay, so that's all cut away, and i got my sticky strip down here. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to do two folds. Now I know we did three score lines, but we're just going to fold on two of them. We're going to fold on this one, the first two essentially, the four and an eighth and the four and a half. Okay, so I've already done that here. Fold it on that. And then in addition, um, down at the bottom where that sticky strip was, you can certainly take that off at this point. And this is just like a little a little pocket, like a little folder pocket. You can put receipts in there and so on and so forth. Okay, so these two lines I've already folded. I folded that one, and we're going to leave it on that fold. Okay, now I'm going to come in real close here. And from about two inches down, we're going to snip in just to that fold line, okay? And then go about a half inch over, or I don't know, three eighths of an inch. Go an inch or so down, and then do it again. So this, what we're creating is a little slot for our pen, and those little pieces are going to push inwards, okay? So I'm pushing them inwards, there we go. Right now as I open it up, see there you go, you can see these slots here. Now, they're folding really nicely here because of that extra score line. Love that. So here's a pen. I'm just going to slide it in. I'm actually going to keep that cap right on there because it can hook. I love that. Isn't that cool? So there you go. Now we're just going to add our notepad. Okay, so here's the notepad. Like I said earlier, it comes with a magnetic strip. I'm just going to pull that off. Okay, and then I've added sticky strip. Okay, so that tapes all off. I'm just going to center it here in our little space that we've created for it here. There we go. There. All right, we just finished this off with this cute little punch art flower, which I actually shared on another video of this card. Um, I just showed how to create this with, as a quick tip video. So be sure to check that out. And be sure to check out more inspiration on my blog at DoStampingWithDawn.com.